Uh, let's see how screws can make their own holes. Here we have three screws. I call the actions and select the screw. And Solid Genius gives you five different hole types you can select from. In this case, I will select the, the counter sunk hole type and select the part to which it applies. And it will automatically even move the screw down if you wish so. Second example here, select the counter bore, apply part, just apply, move the screw down. Third example, select the screw. In this case, I take a simple hole, and of course, screw will not be moved down. So that's it. When we make a section, you see that screws are moved. Let's look at the second example where we have two parts which are which we are screwing together here to this one counter hole and the other one I just make a tapped hole and move the screw down second one again counter bore and a tapped through hole partial tap through hole to this one exactly and we apply all the operations at once move down third one select the screw simple hole or in this case let's do a counter bore again here and um, tap through hole to this part apply all move the screw down okay let's check make a section as you see the holes are created automatically as machining holes and when I move out screws you see the holes better okay now let's take the third example here we have three parts and one screw so I will, if you position the screw into solid material and select the action menu, then I apply three times. The first one applies to this part. The second one is applies to the middle part. And the third one with the tapping through hole applies to this part. And we apply all the operations and move down screw. And now check, let's make make a cross section as you see again all three parts are automatically processed thank you very much